Hey guys, welcome to the top five free editor extensions for July 2017. So number one is an asset called Unipalette. And this is something which lets you sort of manage the colors that you'll find in your game. So you can set a range of colors, whichever you specify based on, you know, whatever your sort of style is towards your game. And you have a palette of range of colors, as you can see in the image here. And you can apply these colors really quickly to UI buttons, game objects, lights, renderers, materials, anything like that. And it will just help you manage all your different colors and styles without you having to, you know, every single time change and decide what color you need if you have them all managed here. Number two is the Hierarchy Restore and this is a nice little editor extension where say one time that you're using your game and you've got lots of different things open up in the hierarchy and you close Unity all hierarchy sort of information will be closed up so all you know your game objects and things and empty game objects that might hold all the different assets that you have within your scene um, you won't be able to access them, they'll all be closed up and what this allows you to do is remember exactly what you were doing in the hierarchy um, and open everything back up just how you left it so it might be a nice little time saver if you know you're often closing unity and coming back to the things that you were previously doing number three is the UN input universal network input and this is a input system which allows you to you know use input and things across a network and this can be allow people to use gamepads and even mobile devices for a game that you might be developing and it supports for up to a, a xbox pads or virtual gamepads which you might use and it comes you know documented for that number four is the debug tools and this is a range of runtime and editor debug tools which allow you to create a lot of different things whether it's an fps counter in the corner whether it's a debug log which is actually on screen or it's actually different graphs and things to show you all about performance within real time without you having to bring up other um, sort of windows and things on top. And number five is the diamond visual scripting. And this suggests is that, as it suggests, is a visual scripting um, extension, which allows you to, instead of, you know, having to write yourself some code, it comes fully documented and easy to generate the C-sharp code based on the, the visual scripting that you produce and it comes with a step-by-step -step documentation manual to guide you through the process of using this. Thanks very much for watching and you can check out all the free assets for July 2017 and I will leave a link in the description for you to check those out. Thanks very much for watching, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.